So, Lady Horse Prada sent us this amazing book. What? Yeah. Do you guys remember uh, she sent us a book last week too? And this one is from the same author, Cherry Hills, and I love her book. This is a horse keeping almanac. And I actually really love this book because it's it's super simple and it has all these tips I'll show you a fall. and tricks. I'll show you a fall. It recommends movies for you. It's got all the information. Yeah, it's got all the information. So this part of the almanac is spring from March to May, and it tells you all the things that you have to do. All the things you should be looking at, doing with your horses, doing with your property. Like, it's just a really good book. Easy to understand. I'm in love with it. This is going to be a book that's going to be like our Bible. It's something that we're going to be looking at a lot. So, thanks Paint Horse Prada. Alright, so this next letter, I'm actually going to cut these out. Because there are pictures. Let's and... see, let's show them. So uh, this person decorated her envelope, which is super cool. The girls really love that. There's Stella jumping a big, huge jump. With me. With with Sophie. Bareback. And then bareback. And that could happen one day, you guys. And then here's Gabby uh, jumping storm. It's super cool. And but then there's and little then, Willow. And then on the back. And then on the back. She made Gabby, Gabby and, Storm. and Storm. Love it. If you guys hear Levi, it's because he's on his tree over there and he does not like that tree. Look at how gorgeous that tree is though. Like, that is a tree of art. <laughs> we made that tree for him and he doesn't want to be there. He wants to be with us eating your guys' letters. Mm -hmm. All, right, All so. right. Who's that amazing letter from? I send Levi fan mail. Oh, yeah. that's adorable. What a good send idea. Send Levi fan mail. Oh, that's such Here's a good idea. See, but Levi particularly loves paper. Oh my god! Aww, Sophie and Stella. It's beautiful. Look at that, is Stella. Gabby Stormy. Oh, I love it. So well done. That's a common photo. Amazing. Hey, I think I remember. Who's this it from? Day. Isn't this day when uh, we went on the on the beach with the pony? Yeah, maybe. Uh, let's read what it says here. For Sophie, you've come so far with confidence and I can't wait to see what happens next. All those bad moments made up for Brooke. the good ones. She's 13. And this is from 13-year-old Brooke. And she says, always let your colors shine. Uh, she has Instagram bd.drawing. And she's from Canada. What does she say to you? We what? have to meet up sometime. Yeah, she's from Toronto. Gabby always reads her own letters privately and then hands them over and then hands them over to me. Just going to get this one. Um, she's 13 years old, going on 14 at the end of May. She's been riding for four years and saving up for her horse for herself. Um, and she likes to make treats. I have a question for you. Ruby interrupts this moment. Yeah, distractions, distractions when you have a house full of pets. Brooke, we are going to the equine. Horse Expo. The Equine Horse Expo uh, coming up in May. And so maybe we'll get to see April. This. Oh, coming up in April. We went there April 4th. Yeah, we went there last and year then too. The 5th um, so maybe we'll get to see you there. I'm just going to cut out all your pictures. And what do you have there? Uh, package. All right. Let's see. Oh. Mm -hmm. Letter. Letter, which I will open because it looks like there's something inside. Uh, Ruby. Ruby's like, send me a letter. Yeah. yeah, guys, Ruby has her own Instagram account. Yeah. Day by day vlogs underscore Ruby. Mm -hmm. Have you been posting pictures on there? Oh my God. <laughs> what is it? Aww. There's these pretty rocks. Oh, I love pretty rocks. I have a container full of rocks. This was obviously sent at Valentine's Day. Oh, it's beautiful. And she colored this beautiful picture, a butterfly, and she wrote this. Look, I love when we get letters from people who have amazing handwriting. Oh my gosh! Aw, Jack. He is a bay and he looks like Storm. Hey, just like baby Jack. Okay, so uh, questions. This is from CJ. She sent fan mail before. She's from London, Ontario, 11 years old. She watches our videos. Um, and you guys are the best. Gabby is perfect for Storm and Sophie is perfect for Stella. Oh, and a letter for Kaylee. You guys, if you want to send Kaylee letters, go ahead and send them to our address and we will pass them along to her. Sam. Amazing. Look, Sam, you can be here and open a letter. <laughs> Levi's like, let me have a letter. 
<laughs> this is from 11 year old CJ and she wants to know are you getting Sophie a new horse? No. We're getting a new horse all to share. Yeah, we're not getting for a... me. Ride. I'm not riding it. We're getting a horse for our family. Whatever happens, whether it's a more advanced horse or a... <coughs> we'll come over. Or a relaxed horse. Happy Valentine's Day. Mm -hmm. um, whoever our new horse, whatever horse God has planned for us, we're just going to be extra picky okay. and make you sure that it's... my letter. Yeah, uh, do Gabby and Sophie have to finish their schoolwork before they get to ride? Sometimes, not in the summer, because in the summer, in, because in the summer it gets really hot out, so we can't ride, so we have to ride in the morning. Yeah, homeschool allows us to alter our schedule all the time, so we can do homework late in the night, we can do homework in the morning or in the afternoon or whenever we need to get it done. Or at like two in the morning. Yeah, it's so pretty. but we do not do homework at two in the morning. Do you do schoolwork at two in the morning? Nobody does. Good. Ah, beautiful picture of Willow. It's amazing how they actually look Wait, like the me? the horse. Like that does look Aww. like Willow. And here comes Levi. He's like, I'm tired of this. I'm coming for you. You want to have a valentine? Look at Val Levi got his very first valentine. See? Whoops. Oops. You dropped it. You dropped it. Okay, cut them all out. There's the letter. There's the remains. <laughs> That's the remains. Oh, that is the remains of your letter. Um, okay, last question. Is it ju is just Sophie going to ride in your arena or no? No. No. Anybody who wants to ride in our arena is going to ride in our arena. Hey, so hey. these are pieces of beach glass. Those are beach glass. Oh, those are beautiful. I'm excited about those. They used to be bottles and they got worn down by rocks and sand in the lake. Wow, isn't that crazy that that can happen? You can take them to the jewelry shop and make it into a piece of jewelry. That's or you cool. Can keep it as it is each person in your family can have one. Kaylee two. And Kaylee two. And Kaylee two. That's they're amazing. Stormy. I like the white ones. Same. Look, they're stormy. Thank you. And they're storm. Uh, so, do we have Kaylee's letter? We'll take that to her tonight and we'll give her a piece of glass. Which one do you want Kaylee to have? This one's mine. Hmm, biggest one. Big surprise. <laughs> Kaylee can have yeah. Why don't you, Gabby and Kaylee, both have a white one? I'll have this one. Okay, give me Kaylee's. And then Dad and I will get the green and the brown. I'll get the green because I really like the green. <laughs> no, Dad's getting the green. No, Dad, no! Look I don't, green. oh, come on, like what? I do all the work and I get- You're wearing brown, look at your shoes. That looks good, it looks like a piece of your poop. <laughs> yeah, I mean, since I just pick up poop all the time. That's <laughs> the biggest one. Mine is almost in a heart shape, look at that. I love hearts. Mom, you're not keeping it. I like the green one. The green one is like, oh, I put that in a necklace. How about, how about you guys both share yeah, them? Yeah, I'll give it to you. All right, thank you, I'll give you the brown one. It's nice too. <laughs> Boys like brown. And here comes Levi again. He's like, get one to me! Here, bud, you can have one. Thanks, CJ. Okay, last letter. No, the last, last two letters. letters. Last two letters. Because Let's see it. Levi bit polka dot. So, uh, this one, Gabby picked because it has polka dots all on it, and it's super cute. Okay, so this is from 11-year-old Rebecca. She's from North Ireland. She's such a big fan, and she's watched all of our videos from the beginning and subscribed. She has four horses. Rosie, Peggy, Polly, and Maisie is a rescue pony. She's been riding for eight years and had a lot of different ponies. In 2018, in October, she had a bad fall jumping 65 centimeters and dislocated and broke her elbow. It was sore. I think I went through the pain like Laura. It is the 7th of February and I'm jumping again. I love you guys so much and love Storm Stella and your mini pony. That is amazing, Rebecca. Oh, there she is. So well done getting back on that horse and jumping again. This is Peggy. Beautiful. She kind of reminds me of Stella. She kind of reminds me of Stella too. 
believe in yourself and don't stop riding. Yeah, yeah, believe in yourself. Oh, is that Peggy? I'm not sure. Beautiful. That was the next letter. I have no idea who it's from. But um, here's the letter. Or is that a letter? Um, so this is... Oh, she... She has previously written a letter to us, and she thinks she sent it two years ago. Oh, wow. This is me going over my first jump on a school horse called Rocky. Mm. Um, so this is from... Rocky, kind of. Australia. This is her over her first jump. Love it. And it is from... Lily, this is from Lily, and she says that she uh, previously wrote a letter to us two years ago. She's a 12-year-old girl living in Australia. She's watched her videos for a while now, and all your riding abilities have progressed so much. I'm on the hunt for my first horse, um, and on the hunt for a good way to convince my parents. <laughs> have any tips? <laughs> that is exactly how you should go about looking for a horse. Excellent idea. Uh, find the perfect one, and then convince them that way. Mm -hmm. Um... I'm currently leasing my neighbor's horse, and he is not my forever horse. In fact, we are complete opposites. She rides in a western saddle at the moment, but I really want to try out English riding since I would love to get more into jumping. I love advancing in my riding, and right now I'm about Gabby's stage, but the horse that I lease hates going any faster than a trot. So last week when I asked him to go into a canter, he tried to buck me off. <laughs> Fortunately, though, I stayed on. Laura, I hope you're okay after your broken pelvis, but as you said in your story from horserookie.com, you will heal day by day. I'm so happy for you guys that Gabby found Storm and that Sophie found Stella. Since last time I wrote to you, Gabby and Sophie were still riding Blue, Ziggy, and Sabrina. Thank you, Lily. As always, thank you guys so much for your letters. Um, the next time we open letters, we're going to let Levi open a letter. So if you want Levi no, to... No, it has to be a package so that he doesn't rip the letter. So if you guys want Levi to choose your letter and open it, um, then send mail to Levi. Yes. Oh, and he like little rock presents so like he can tear it open. And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.